Hey, how are you going? I hope you're having a good day or good night, depending on where you are. Today, I'm gonna to be showing you how to turn your photos from something like this and give it a nice reflection like this. All right, so first step, upload your photo into Photoshop, and then you wanna press the V key, which is gonna be this little thing here, and then just drag the image up to where you want it to be. So compose the image. The next thing you wanna do is press M, and then just drag from the top here, and just drag the part that you want to reflect. So if you have an image that has water already in it, it's just going to be where the water line ends, which is just here. Or if you don't have any water in your image, just drag it to where you want the reflection to be. You want to press Command J, which is going to duplicate that layer and just take out that top part. Press V again, then press Command T, which is going to be the transform tool. And then just go to your height here and just go minus in front of the 100. So now you've got minus 100% as the height, which is just gonna flip it over. Then you just wanna bring this top layer down and then just match it to where it looks like a reflection and that will snap in. All right, so we've got a reflection, but it looks fake. It's clearly way too perfect. So we're gonna add a bit of motion blur. So we'll click on this top layer here. We'll go into filter. We'll go down to blur here and then go on motion blur. So for this, I've already got it here. You wanna have the angle at 90 and then have the distance at 45. The distance you can change depending on the photo. Whatever just looks realistic. You don't wanna have it all the way up because it just looks fake and then you don't wanna have it too little. So I think having it around 45 is a good option. Honestly, that's pretty much it. It's only a couple of clicks and it gives a really cool effect. Let me know in the comments, what tutorials do you wanna see? Like this quick sort of style because I know when I watch tutorials, I hate the ones that are really long and boring and just talk on forever. So if you want to see something or if you want to know how something is done, I'll make a video about it and I'll just make it quick, snappy, no bullshit, just straight to the point. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you're a photographer and you're wanting some presets, I've just released my new preset pack. It includes 20 different presets along with instructional videos showing you how to actually use the presets. So you're not going to be lost. You're not going to download these presets and be like, what the fuck did I just download? Like, I don't even know how to use these. I'll be taking you through each preset, telling you what photos you should use them on and how to fine tune each preset to your photo. I'll leave the link for those presets down in the description below so you can go and check them out if you want. Thanks for watching today's video. As always, stay inspired, keep creating, and I'll see you in the next one.